Danielle is back and I'm here with another video and right now I am trying this Japanese ice cream it's called mochi ice cream um, and what it really is is just like the outside of it is like a white um, it's like a rice dough kind of supposed to sort of feel like cookie dough it's like a rice dough on the outside and an ice cream filling on the inside mochi normally has different types of fillings on the inside it can be like jelly or custard but this one has ice cream so i stopped at my local whole foods to pick it up it's also available in trader joe's down here right now in florida um i don't know where you guys can where you guys live but you can look it up as well if you have a whole foods or trader joe's by you or a japanese store or asian market then you can probably pick them up there but i got mine from whole foods each one was two dollars and the outside is covered with like a a a powder so this is how they look um there's different flavors i picked up two strawberries two mango two vanillas one matcha green tea and one regular green tea so i'm going to try one of each i'm going to just cut them in half on c okay the strawberry started leaking so and so did mango so this is the strawberry one it has a powdered filling on the out and powdered like donut on the outside. And this is how it looks. So here goes. Tastes really good. The powder gets everywhere. But it's like, it's just like a gummy. So that one is the strawberry one. I'm going to try mango next. Mango is just okay. Like. It's like rice still. The next one is vanilla. It's like vanilla bean. It's not bad though. This one is regular green tea. And then this one I think is matcha green tea. So you can kind of see the difference in color. Like the powder I think is to prevent them from sticking. But This rice, this um rice dough on this one is really hard. So maybe this one is old. I don't like this one like that. And then the last one is matcha. Green tea. So let's see. Because I like green tea stuff, so I don't know. This one you definitely taste the matcha in. So I prefer this one over the other green tea one. I'm not eating that green tea when I taste the yuck. But this matcha green tea. I just kind of have a hard time biting into the stuff because. If, if you can't chew cold things, like I can't chew cold things, so. I 
if you just eat the rice powder stuff alone, it tastes really like disgusting because it doesn't really have that much of a flavor. So it tastes really kind of nasty. It's really chewy. It's like you're chewing, 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 chewing. It's a really chewy texture that tastes better if you eat it with the ice cream. I made a complete mess over me, you guys. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to try matcha for yourself, go check out your local Whole Foods, Trader Joe's, or a Japanese Asian market. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe once you are down there giving that video a thumbs up. And hit that notification button so that you know when I upload. And thank you so much for watching. If you want to leave a comment, go ahead. I don't mind talking to you guys. Worry less, laugh more, smile often. Bye, you guys.